excited because I've never been in Vietnam and actually I was more excited because this is my first time in Asia and this year and no one and you know not all the people from America can do it so I, I feel privileged and um, also I feel privileged to know a new culture like the Vietnamese culture no, I haven't. Actually, um, I feel a little bit bad from my stomach, so I'm only taking soups. So I wish I could recover and try all, all, all the Vietnamese. Yes, yes I have. I have actually. I went um, on February to Japan to the festival, the Sapporo Snow Festival, and then Jakarta for the culture in Indonesia. And then I went to Mexico, Panama, Ecuador, Myanmar, and Vietnam. Yes. That I have already visited? <laughs> no, I haven't. This is my very first time in, in Vietnam, but I've heard a lot about your beaches. One of the things that I, I will keep working on is that because I feel passion about the project I choose for Miss Venezuela International and then to Miss International because I'm a history teller and I know the power of the books and I know the power of reading, of the education and um, of course I will, I will keep working on that and until now I have worked a lot and when I went to Panama, I visited the, the kids from a, a public school and um, told them like, stories about uh, the prevention of HIV and a lot of things. Then I went to Miami in, in Florida, in the United States um, and also had a moment to share to, to with kids and all the funds and the, the, the money we collected was um, destined to a uh, hospital back in my in my hometown El Tigre in Venezuela and um, that's the the wish I was that was my third wish yeah. oh my god um, most of the books that I remember and that I keep in my heart are um, the books from my from my childhood, okay. But um, one of them was um, the Little Prince. I don't know if it's, that's the translation. I think um, every every adult, every adult, every um, person in, in the world have to learn. It's not only for for kids. So um, it has a beautiful. A beautiful uh, <laughs> lesson. Yes, yeah. So uh, I think the first time I read it, I, I didn't understand a lot of stuff. But then, once reading it again, older, right, and maybe four years ago, I understood more things. So I think that that will be the point. Okay, um, this is one of them. Um, everywhere I go, I make sure that people know my culture and, and know where I came, where I, I come from. Venezuela is a beautiful country, and right now we are not facing a, uh, a great moment. It's kind of, it's very difficult what we what we're living, and um, every time I visit a new a new country. Most of them, the Latin American countries next to my country, the, the next, the ones next to my country, just around them. I make sure to say thank you to all of the people from from, from all of the countries because they are contributing, helping Venezuelan people to improve. There's every day is a challenge because you have to challenge yourself, and um, every time. I have a public appearance. I try to make to be myself and also to, to represent my country and represent Miss International Organization. So it is not easy when there's a lot of people telling you what to do or who you, how you have to handle things or how you have to to communicate. And um, so 
I keep always, I try to be always myself and forget about what all the people says and just uh, make sure to pay attention to the good um, comments to the people, of the people. What do I think about her? Um, she's a beautiful girl and um, today actually we had a catwalk lesson. So I gave her some advices um, from a Venezuelan means, you know, we are uh, known because of our catwalk. So <laughs> I'm not saying I'm, I'm the best on it, on it, I'm not actually, but um, I do have some, some recommendations to her and I gave her and also we had a beautiful time and um, I know she's going to do a great job. I have two months to think about it, but right now it would be what I said before. Um, I think that uh, I think that the, the power to, to accomplish your goals, to make your dreams come true, is being yourself. I know it sounds like everyone says you have to be yourself, but what I mean is more than that. When you do something, it has to come from your heart. And when you say thank you, it has to be a meaningful and a grateful thank you. And um, that's what I think that it has to be my, my successor. That's what I think that the next, the next international has to has to, to look for because when you when you are genuinely doing something everything comes to you and the, and what when you do good when you do something good the world returns to you so i think that is my advice thank you so much